This is a game called Zack. It seems relatively new. Hopefully it's not bad. Press A or... Okay, A I assume is if you have a controller. Ah, yes. It is if you have a controller. It only supports that... Oh, okay, never mind. Yeah, full controller support, that's nice. Okay then. Jump over the barbed wire fence into apparently District 13. No? Okay. Checkpoints. Nice. Get nice. And boxes break if they land on your hand. That's kind of nice. Gonna try and get through here without dying. Doop. Nice. Ah, crud. Ah, uh, well, failed already at that. Well then. Ha. Okay. Turn all the way around before hitting things. Crap. Mice cannot walk on boxes, good to know. Doesn't seem like there's anything coming out of any of these boxes. Don't know why I'm still breaking them. Nice. Little cave, spike floors. Always a good sign. Crap. No one, expe no one expects green rats to be on the platform that they're jumping to in the dark. Green bats. What a change. Using the lead pipe method of diplomacy. Crud. No, it didn't look like there was anything down there. Dang. I don't know what I was expecting there. Jump before you get to the edge. Ah, dang it! Nice. I don't know how I managed to do that. Without killing myself. Ah. It's always the rat you don't kill. That kills you, I guess. That's the bombing plate or something. Presumably these guys are all radioactive rabies. Or rabid. Is I suppose how you would say it. Rabid with the radioactivity. There we go. Ah, crud. No. Okay. Up the left side. I already killed everything up. Ah, crud. Yeesh. So many things that will kill you if you touch them.
At least the checkpoint function is fairly nice. And that they give a checkpoint every few screens worth of jumping. And the enemies stay dead. Ah, great. Now there's people with guns. Whose line of sight is blocked by boxes. Has it turned into a stealth game? I think it has. Hup! Dodge. Hup! Crud! Ah! Do not be directly in front of them when they shoot. Got it. Crud. Miss the ground. Platforming, one of my several weaknesses. Damn it. The trick is to push the jump button at the right time. That's all the game is. Ah, crud! Master that one move, and you've mastered everything. Dang it! Then it's just a matter of pressing the sticks, or left and right, at the right times. Oh, dang it! I don't know why I backed off there. Terrible move. Three, two, jump! Ooh, dang. Jump, jump, jump! And out of there. Crud. Dodge the bullets. Do not walk into the bullets. Okay. Crud. Alright, that guy has a... Relatively quick turn cycle, which I am offsetting every single time I walk into this guy's path. Crud. Crud. Got it. Ah. There's a ceiling there. Crud. Crud. Missed the jump. Oh. Got distracted looking at the bottom row. Crud. Okay, there I go. There they go. Ah. Too soon. Jump too late. Crud. Come on, and ah, crud. Too soon, or too far over. Eesh. That was terrible. Oop, crud. And he turns, and whoop, dig it. Add move by me. Three, two, go. Three, two, go. Ah, dang it! Wait for the next pass. Go. Ah, damn it! Damn it! Damn. I could probably just kill him, but... Eh, then there's absolutely no challenge. 
God damn it. No. Utter failure. God. Mm. Ah, Crud got stuck on the lip. Nope. Too far forward. Damn it. And up. Oh, got it. Oh. I don't know what I was doing there. Okay. Crap. Oh. That was a bad move. Too bad I don't, like, leave corpses behind. I could eventually make a pile and just block off everyone's view. Crud, jump too high. Crud, didn't jump high enough. Ah, dang. Guy turned around. thing I gave up on. I wonder if these cell casings can eventually pile up enough that they'll block their view. Ah, damn it! And I just saw the place I needed to jump to. Crap. Damn it. Hurried that time, I could have made it. Damn it. Should jump sooner or something. what I was doing there. Ah, crud. The box isn't big enough? Damn it. Oh. Dodge one bullet, walk directly in front of the guy who shoots me at point blank range. Great. Huh? Oof. Well, hopefully now he has more room for walking around, so he'll turn around less often, which will allow me to get to this area. Got it. Hmm. Kind of what I figured would happen. There, though. Oh, it's just over there to kill the guy, I guess.
One, two, three, go. Ah, crud. What have I here? Oh, it seems to be a cave-in of some sort, and people running away from it. Oh, crap. What the hell? Interesting. Crud. Whoop. Alright. Judging from... absolutely nothing, I wager that this is an allegory for the powers of nature versus the hubris of man just from the fact that these are giant floating eyeballs, and it's colored purple, which may represent that it's some sort of repository of knowledge, or byproduct of the said. Ah, crud. And Zack is powered by lightning, which contributes to the magical respawning and jumping power, I guess. There we go. Ow. No, my bar I bar. Uh pipe. What the crap? And then this one's powered by the speed force? No. Radioactivity. Well, that was that. I don't know what that's supposed to mean. Uh? Spades, hearts? So hearts would be what? The ones where I... No kills. No kills. No deaths. All right. Well, I'll try and do that then. Next time.